Okay, well, as we are nearing the, yes, as we are nearing near to the game's um, actual release. Okay, basically, there's an updated article on uh, Wikipedia. So, um, so it contains Fighting Ground World Two and Battle Hop. So, Fighting Ground contains local and online versus battles, as well as training and arcade modes, all featuring. Similar 2D fighting gameplay to the previous games in the series, in which two fighters use a variety of attacks and special abilities to knock out their opponent. World Tour is a single player story mode featuring a customizable player avatar exploring 3D environments such as Final Fights, Metro City, and a small nation of niche of reaction and adventure gameplay. So, Battle Hop acts as an online lobby mode using customizable player avatars from the world tour mode. In the battle hub, players can compete in ranked or casual matches bet better using their created avatars, participate in special events or play emulated Capcom arcade titles using the same emulation technology used in the Capcom arcade stadium series among other features. The, the main fighting gameplay of Street Fighter 6 is based, on the, based around the drive gauge a system designed to encourage player creativity. The gauge can be used for five different techniques requiring players to choose which to prioritize. Most of the drive gauges mechanics are based on previously existing mechanics from previous Street Fighter mainline games such as parry, focus, that EX move, etc. The game features three control types, the classic control scheme which has a six button Lay out their functions similarly to previous entries. The modern control scheme assigns special moves to a single button combined with a directional input, and the dynamic control scheme, which is only allowed in certain parts of in the fighting ground mode, but it's not allowed in online battles, uses a single button auto attack layout based on what range is performed. The use of multiple super, super combos returns from the Street Fighter Alpha sub-series, also counting the Ultra Combo W variant from Ultra Street Fighter 4. However, each character has only has three super combos based on their respective level gauge. For example, Ryu Shinku Hadouken, Shin Asogeki, and Shin Shoyuken can only be used at level 1, 2, and 3 respectively. When the player is not on health, their level 3 super move will become a critical art, which is more powerful in addition to having, having an expanded cinematic scene. Certain movesets can only be cancelled to super moves based on how many levels the player has filled, such as EX Overdrive special moves which only can be cancelled to higher levels above level 1, while regular special moves without sacrificing the drive gauge can only be cancelled to level 3. An extreme battle type is also available for play, allowing players to compete in matches that feature special rules and gimmicks. A real-time commentary system is a brand new feature in Street Fighter 6, where English and or Japanese commentators watch the action in real time, giving it a more tournament-style feel or allow the option to cheer the player on. Eight different commentators are featured, four of which all of which of the two commentary types, play by Bay commentary and color commentary, the latter being optional. Aru, Jeremy Vicious, Topaz, Steve Tasty, Steve Scott, and Kosuke Hiraiwa will be the four play by Bay commentators. Well, Demon Kaka, Dear Zelina Vega Trinidad, that's from WWE by the way. Uh, she's signed to WWE. So it's uh, James J. J. Chen, Sir Chen and Hikaru Takahashi will be the other, will be the four color commentators. So this guy is actually uh, age 21. He's very young actually. Hikaru Takahashi uh, is an actress, age 21 for this, uh, this game itself. And that's the update for the uh, Street Fighter 6 article. And then the and then Days of Eclipse, a prequel comic book series doc Days of Eclipse by Wulong Entertainment was announced on November 9th, 2022, which explains how this game heavily focuses on Ken Kimberly and those stories. 
The comic was released on May 5th, 2023 digitally and was released in bookstores on May 6th, 2023.